Hello and welcome to Crazy Hank TV. We got a new segment today. It's called It's on Netflix. Should I watch it? It's where we'll watch a show or movie and we'll give you our reviews and our thoughts if you should watch it. A couple weeks ago we did one on the Bird Box. Some people liked it. Some people didn't like it. Uh, you can check. I'll put it in the comment section, the link to the video. You can go watch it. If you're a subscriber and click the little bell, you'll know the new video is up. And you'll have already known that we did a review on the Bird Box. So subscribe and tell a friend. And tell that, tell that friend to tell a friend, and so on and so on. Uh, I decided, I was watching previews on Netflix uh, last night, and I saw a preview for a doom and gloom type show, which I love. And it was uh, called I.O., starring Margaret Qualley and Anthony Mackie. Um, it doesn't have a big cast, and I hope I'm pronouncing Margaret's last name correctly, because I was watching the whole the show the whole time going, what was she in? What was she in? And it was, I looked it up afterwards, it was a leftover. You'd think I would have known that since I used to do a podcast on the leftovers, but... That's okay, we forget things. Uh, both actors do a great job. Um, I would have to admit though, when I originally saw the preview, I thought it was the name of the, t the show was 10. So I'm thinking, oh, we're gonna get like a zombie uh, Bo Derek running down the beach. But turns out I was wrong, it wasn't 10. I'm an idiot, it's I.O. And I, cause they kept saying I.O. And I go, well, what does this have to do with 10? So anyway, you, you gotta ignore me sometimes. But anyway, it's it's a show. Basically, we you, we humans have destroyed Earth, and the remaining survivors have jettisoned off to a uh, space station around Jupiter. Uh, Margaret's character Sam has stayed behind with her dad Henry. They're trying to reverse the wrongs of what happened on Earth to see if they can rejuvenate Earth and bring it back to life, so they don't have to fly up to you know, so we can you know start over again. Um, I really wanted to love this movie. I didn't hate it. But I didn't love it. After it was over, I was kind of, ah, okay, you know. There were a few, I thought, predictable things that happened in it that was not shocking or shattering. No pun intended. Uh, on the Crazy Hank scale of one being bad, four being good, I'll give it two and a half Crazy Hanks. Not quite three. Um, not quite two. It's, you know, again, two and a half. It's, it was good, but far from great. If you have other shows on your list, watch those first. If you have nothing to watch, give it a shot. It's, it was never boring. There wasn't any point where I was like, oh, God, I'm just bored. Because the, 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 the two characters do a good job interacting. You kind of care what's going on with them. But it wasn't, oh, my God, this is just this is just gripping me. It's so exciting. Um, anyway, that's all I got. Um, if you like this video, you can subscribe to us again. A little button there says subscribe. And, and tell a friend. Tell, tell that friend to tell a friend. And we'll, we'll keep posting these videos. About, we'll try and do like once a week or once every two weeks a... Something from Netflix to let you know what's going on. But that's all I got. I'm out of here. Thanks for watching. Bye.